There were rumors that Elon Musk is planning to open a gigafactory in Texas, and recently, some pictures showcasing the construction of the factory surfaced over the internet. So, that means finally, the gigafactory is under construction. So, let's get a glimpse of this amazing factor under development in this video. Elon Musk stated that Tesla is planning to invest around 10 billion US dollars in a Texas gigafactory and will employ around 20,000 workers. The Tesla organization is expecting to start the production of Model Y at Texas Giga Factory in Austin any day now. The factory is somehow critical to the expansion of Tesla's plans in the US, and currently, Tesla sells all its cars they make in the US. The model also has some delivery timelines for some of its popular vehicles closer to the year. All the Tesla models were sold in the US market and were manufactured at the Fremont factory in California which can produce around 500,000 electric vehicles every year. The Texas Gigafactory is expected to double its output once it is entirely ramped up, but that is some time away. The automaker and manufacturer are all set to start with the first Model Y, the popular model at the new factory. The Tesla organization is guiding to start with the production by the end of the year. With a start in its production, there will be about 60 million US dollars in incentive that the government provides Tesla to build the Austin factory. Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, stated that the Tesla organization is planning to invest around 10 billion US dollars over time and will have 100,000 indirect jobs. Some recent filings also revealed that Tesla is spending a whopping 1 billion US dollars on this production, but that is for the phase of a new factory. Once Tesla deploys the semi production and cyber truck at the factory, the investment will expand greatly. Furthermore, the automaker also moved its headquarters at the site that will expand beyond the manufacturing operations over time. So, Tesla had mentioned that 10,000 employees would be there, but Musk stated that there would be 20,000 employees and Tesla has around 100,000 employees worldwide. Surprisingly, the aim to start the first production at the massive factory is before the end of 2021 and volume production by 2022, but that is not surely happening. The factory is planned to be the primary factory for Tesla Semi and Cybertruck production, and it will also produce Model Y and Model 3 cars for the East US. The factory will also serve as the site of the corporate headquarters of Tesla that was formally announced in the past two years. The Giga Factory received state tax incentives worth 50 million US dollars through the Texas Tax Code Chapter 313 program. The first entirely completed Tesla model, Y will roll off the line at Giga Texas in August 2021 under some trial work. A lot of progress has been made since January 18 and 19 in 2021, when concrete foundations for three Giga Press high press die casting machines were poured at the northeast corner of the Texas Giga factory location. Then on 21st January 2021, the first Giga Press components arrived on the site in shipping containers and crates. On the next day, on 22nd January 2021, the base frame of the first Giga Press was craned and unboxed to its position. Giga Presses are some aluminum die casting machines manufactured and produced by the Hydra Group in Italy. They are highly notable for being the largest high pressure die casting machines worldwide, possessing a clamping force of 55,000 to 61,000 kilonewtons. Each machine in the factory weighs around 410 to 430 tons. The base specification of Gigapress machines was included in IDRA's catalog from 2018, utilizing around OL6100 CS Gigapress initiated by Tesla in 2020 to produce chassis parts of the Model Y. Some shots of molten aluminum weighing around 80 kilograms were also injected into the cold chamber, casting mold boasting a velocity of 10 meters per second. The cycle time is around 80 to 90 seconds and allows the output rate of 40 to 50 complete castings every hour. In all, die casting works by forcing molten metal alloy inside the reusable mold, then opening the mold to remove all the finished pieces after getting them solidified. The open mold is then cooled at 185 degrees Celsius and cleaned by robots for fresh molten aluminum to be prepared for the next cycle to start in one to two minutes after the first cycle. Every fresh casting is trimmed to approximate measure, size, checked for imperfections, and sent for CNC machining to finish size. The factory will also incorporate the Tesla Giga press-based casting operation, where the ingots and offcuts aluminum are melted using a natural gas-powered melting oven at 850 degrees Celsius. Also, to prevent the formation of oxides, a nitrogen tank covers the aluminum, which is then circulated to prevent an even temperature. 
All these procedures will happen inside the gigantic facilities finished in Austin, and construction in Giga, Texas is about to finish in the upcoming weeks. We can get an idea of what will happen in the factory and how the models will be produced with all these. What are your views on the entire procedure? Are you surprised? Let us know your views in the comments below. Until the next, stay tuned and subscribe for more.